Oh, hello and good day everyone again. My name is Sebastian and you are watching The Novice Prospect. We're back in Space Engineers. We're still in, on episode 6-ish. It's a impromptu live stream that I decided to do on Sunday. After about an hour and three minutes, OBS conked out. I did not realize. And so there is an hour's worth of footage missing. The stream stopped. The recording stopped. Everything just completely went to shit. Excuse my language, because even when I tried to stop uh, OBS, it then basically freaked out my whole computer. So yeah, there is that. Um, the last you've basically seen, I've just checked the recording there, is that I was working on the button panel. <clears throat> Sorry for the drills to extend that. But in the meantime, a few more things have happened. Um, well, not so much happened, I've, I've done more things. Uh, so, let me, once we're loaded up, let me walk you through it. We have a large cargo container, finally. We have retrofitted the rover. It has two, well, they're the small lager cargo containers, but they're still better than the tiny ones with the small uh, conveyors. So we've got two of them now, and there's, uh, I've done stone ejecting and sorters. And I will quickly walk you through that setup, um, just so you can understand on what I've done there. Because it's all gone. It's all been lost. So there is that, right? It's, it is what it is. Um, I actually was just about to go and drill for iron. Um, I feel like I want to show you the base quickly first. We can then... Now, we know roughly where we want to be, so that's fine. Give me the base, and we're going to just go and head over here at full pelt. And then let go and hope that the inertial dampness slows us down <laughs> enough. So, cool. Um, and so this is the setup at base. I have an industrial sorter here. And if we go and look at the settings... Right. Again, this is all stuff you probably have missed, I think, so let's go through it. I have a whitelist that basically just pulls out ores. Anything that has an ore, pull it. On the rover, there is a slightly different setup, and we'll get to that in a second, right? Um, and then there's just a the connector here, so I can back it into it with the rover, and it'll pull the components. We have also, in the meantime, built a big refinery, as well as a proper assembler, right? So we're upgraded there we're a little bit faster um i think i've uh, you may not have seen this but we have upgraded the components needed and wanted considerably um and i will do the same here and say 50 for example because we were going to build solar soon right um but other than that i'm quite happy and say okay we are fit to go what i want to do is quickly recharge my energy oh f and then maybe i can now show you if i was to, to go and say go and take that container stick it in there right you'll see it disappear yes okay and then if i just go and check in general inventories right just in general there is there's all my inventories here and if i go and look for a bottle there is a container called tools ammo balls right and that's so if i had extra grinders or welders they would appear in here which by the way um we can do just like so i'm gonna take this one back nice and then let's go and charge up this suit quickly Right, boom, done. Let's go and back to our diggy hole. Okay, and then I can show you the rover quickly on what I've done there. Nice. So, and then we're going to just come down here slowly. Um, so, the rover, as I say, has now got two of those large cargo containers, or larger. And then I've slapped more batteries, big batteries, um, on there. I've chopped in the, uh, away the antenna, the ore detector, all that stuff that lives now underneath here. So underneath those cargo containers. 
Um, and here's the ejector and sorter setup. So this sorter basically says anything that's stolen, pull it out, and then the ejector will just chuck it out. Um, and there is another sorter in between this connector and that cargo container. It's literally on this block level. There's another sorter there that says uh, blacklist ice. Right, and that's all there is to it. Now, anything else gets pulled out, anything that stone gets pulled out on this bit, uh, on this bit, gets ejected, and yeah, off you go. Right, it is as simple as that. I have dug a hole. Where is it? Can't no normally miss it. Like, big freaking hole. Whee! Let's come down here. And I was after iron, so let's go this direction. Because I think I've pretty much exhausted the other little iron patch that I had there. So... I felt it was time to go for something that lies a bit deep and has a likelihood of being quite a rich vein. Right, so let's go and see the extent of this guy, if we can. Now, this is all right clicking, this is all just me getting rid of voxels that are stone. <coughs> Right, but this this looks quite rich. So let's go and just start digging away at this. And then there's a safe. I've got stone. I'm not too worried because the ejectors will take care of that for me. Um, right, fantastic. Hole, up, back, out, uh, rover. You better not have this point there. Um, and we, we, we can't deposit materials in that way. That's not going to work. And I don't know, but I may have put myself in a bad position. But we'll see. Can I <coughs> do... That's not even a port. There's a port there. Can I to access it? And can I do this? Yes, I can. Nice. Right, and now interesting, you see there's no stone disappearing because I have set in, set both of them up in the group and said to them only eject when I put them on. But now you should see, yes. Bam. And it's going to get rid of the stone for us. Um, that we're sort of digging up and we can just concentrate on the actual out the actual wars like I like that I'm just gonna pick up anyways you know it might be iron in there you never know and then even if we did bring stone back home remember even if we're making gravel from it um, we have a gravel eject at home so you know that, that's all fine too and I really wanted quite a healthy load of iron to start with. Ooh. Well, the dampness of that would make sense. Uh, I can be a bit of an idiot sometimes. And I mean that very politely. <laughs> isn't sometimes, isn't sometimes, it's all the time. Right, come on. i, I just seen you there. But stick all that in there, nice. Um, gold? No, not so much. Cobalt is that away. Let's see. Where's the hole? Well, let me try and do something here. Yeah, yeah, I know. This is well, it's actually all right. Uh, cobalt, that away. 150. Let's see if we can say like so. Just ignore all the stone in, them, in the way. I feel like rather than having two holes, I'd rather go and just dig a little sort of tunnel from my entrance. Because ultimately, I'll always first go by the nav point that I've set for this mine sort of thing. Right, 
and I, I do realize it's not very entertaining. But I like to do things a little bit slower. Sort of at my own pace and Slowly but surely we're sort of working our way towards the cobalt. I want to be further down I think. Like it, it feels like I'm not heading downwards enough. I may well go and then once I've found the cobalt just do a straight dig up just to find the quickest exit. I don't know yet. But yeah, trying to just I'm trying to be not so obtrusive on the surface, like in terms of manipulated voxels. I don't care what I'm doing underneath, but I, I want to leave the surface fairly intact. I mean, it's different at my base with that big drill rig, but so it comes with the territory. Alright, okay, cool, let's go that way. This is some tunnel, by the way. Just glad I'm not carrying all that stone back, forth and back. <laughs> uh, let's see here. Come on. We're nearly there. There we go. That's the stuff. That's that's what we're looking for. Yeah, this looks good. Uh, get rid of that. And then, I don't know, do we want to try and just go straight up? Because gold is right here as well, like, so where where did we come from? We came from that away, right? and you see gold's right there. Well, let's, let's go and do the thing. Might as well. I'm going to pick up a little bit of gold. Yeah, yeah this seems fine. I'm nearly there. Oh, hello, there we go. Nice. Pick some of this up. Now, if I remember right, gold is actually one of those that we would need an efficiency model module for, because it is really rare to, or it's a, it's a really bad drop, if you will. Um, So that may be a thing that me we may have to consider. But anyways, cobalt. Dum -ba -dum -ba -dum -ba -dum. Just gonna fill this whole inventory up as much as I can. Don't think I'm gonna need that much to be quite honest. Like how much cobalt have we got now? Nearly 2k, okay, let's... Let's go and supplement it like so, and then I'm gonna go back up to the iron bit. Um, fill up, and then literally just grab more iron. This, this is some trick we've done here, holy moly. And by the looks of it, this is a fairly big vein. Of iron, like, yeah, yeah, you can drop that there, that's fine. And then we're gonna just go and head to the rover. Wherever it is, there it is. Now let's do the thing, very... Yep, cool. And then we're just gonna fill up on iron as much as we can. If we can put more in the rover, I will. Otherwise, I'll just be on parts. Dinky dinky dink. Thank you. So, 
Yeah, no, I, I like I like what we what we're doing here. And getting all these resources together. And like I I, I said this obviously it would have been a time when uh, okay, I'm sorry for, um, when the stream was interrupted, but I was saying that once we have a proper assembler and refinery, yeah, things are going to be a lot easier for us. We, we, oh my goodness, yeah, it's still taking a whole load. And there's a whole bunch of stone getting chucked out, I can hear that. Thank you, I'll take you. Now, and... When I mine like this, when I actually get the resources, I don't care about how I manipulate the voxels. I could not care less. You know, the thing at home base, you know, that's that's a different story because I may have plans for that. I, I may want a nice tunneled out section that actually looks a little bit appealing and you know worthwhile building in. And it was really that I wanted sort of a good space that I feel yeah I can build in. And have a good idea of the space that I'm occupying, if that makes sense. Oh, for goodness sakes. There. Oh my goodness, yeah, yeah, I'll take it, I'll take it. See, this is what I was meaning with those small cargo containers. Blinking useless, yeah. ultimately. Whereas, I mean, this is what now the third lot that we've just put in. And it's still. I can still grab more. Ah, oh, that's great. Yeah, we're gonna just, as I say, we'll just grab more of this stuff. Because, like, iron is our biggest sort of uh, resource. Not hang up, but it's, it's, it's the one thing that's gonna slow us down the most. Um, so, we might as well grab a healthy supply. There we go. Oh, one component could not be deposited. Yeah, we're, we're full. Like, yeah, there was a bit of stone there, but it's like, nah, don't care, keep with food. <laughs> no, that's great. Um, I would imagine it's literally completely. Yeah. Cobalt. So I'm just quickly looking through, and those 64 liters, I'm not even gonna consider that. So this is, yeah, definitely full. Can we just. Drop this stone then, please, because we really have no need for it. Well, we've got about 45 tons of iron on the grid. I think that will do. Oh, we we're stuck on that bit of, a bit of iron. I don't care about the unknown signal. Where is my base? Um, sorry, I was missing the waypoint there. It's there, yeah, I was going to say. What am I looking at? So, let's go get back home. Okay. And... Yeah, I don't know what I want to build next. If, if I want to go and expand the industrial complex that we have or do I want to work more on the rover or are we actually going to try and get something that can fly I am hmm, I am almost tempted to try and build something that can fly I, I feel that could be a thing we could do. You know, at least start with some sort of layout and get an idea of what we want from this ship. I mean, first and foremost, it's going to be needing to carry a lot of resources. That's sort of the first one. Um, I wanted to mine. I wanted to be able to do atmospherics. I don't know if I want to be able to expand it to interstellar space or if we're going to build something new for that. 
you know, I'm, I'm not the best of builders, to be quite frank with you. And I, I would rather just sort of build the only necessary vehicles I absolutely need. Slowly. Ah. Okay, I... I'm going to have to do a thing here. Just bear with me. Stop, please. So, first of all, we're going to do a thing where... This. But... And I need more steel plate. Right, that's just going to be a thing now. And just give me... Yeah, that'll, that'll do because all I need to do is just build out the platform more. Right. And this is why I love build and repair. You know, once you've done your sort of base building and you've 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 done the tedious work, um, when I do things like this, I, I want to just lay it out and say, okay, let's go and here's my build. <laughs> Um, I've had been wondering about hinge on this, but uh, I've got to try something. Right, there, there, there's things we can do with the suspension as well. So watch. Um, first off, we're gonna go and just back up into it. Now that that should be also on the same sort of height. Uh, that's the whole sort of point of these platforms. Just trying to get the front wheels to line up better. Are we completely off? Oh, that's what Sebastian said. Yeah, that, that should lock us in. Right? Bam. Nice. And there you go. It's pulling things straight out of that inventory. This is what I love. Um, about space engineers once you have something really sort of set up and you can do things like this like oh I'm just gonna back into it and we now go and look through um, say the refinery yeah whole bunch of cobalt iron um, where's the other refinery yeah that guy is just sort of plodding away at it as well um, bits of stone it finds is like yeah <laughs> quickly deal with it, get it out of the way. Um, also, so we have we've changed the button panel, it's went forward a little bit, we have one function free at the moment. Um, but, well, okay. Is it still moving down? Or is this at maximum extension? It looks like maximum extension. So. Let's... No, that's, this is entirely the wrong thing. We're gonna turn the drills off. <clears throat> right, the wobbliness should stop. Then we're gonna turn the rotor lock off and just bring it all up. Okay. Just just get it all up to the top. Um because I feel like resources aren't really such a big issue right now. Let's go and just leave the drill you know, just doing its thing. The only thing I will do if I can is take that, where is it? That rotor, right? And I would like to set a Is this done through limits? I, I really don't want to do it through limit. So we're doing rotor lock at the moment. Right, and I'm just going to go... Until it's, I feel it's 90 degrees. Point 0.1 forwards. Right, and then we're going to do a rotor lock when we're at 90 degrees. Just, just bear with me, just leave me to it. Because um, <clears throat> I have a hope and a plan. So while well, that's coming up, that's nice. Exactly 90 degrees, if I've done my math right. In my 
understanding of it all. Uh, so velocity goes back to point 0.2, that's the normal velocity for that thing, right? And then, yeah, you just, just bring it all up. And I need to look at it all, but I think I can pull it in. I think I can pull it in. But it's... Uh, we'll see. I'll bring it up first and then look at it again. Anyways, plenty of materials. We're getting rid of junk. You know, we have a little bit of automation going on, if you will. Um, we are always well stocked on materials that we need. Let me go and go through this hydrogen bottle. I would like to always have three of those on hand. Okay. Uh, welders. Uh, okay. Yeah, I always have one on hand, but we're going to replace that with a proper one if I can. Um, but yeah, no, okay, cool. But I like things like that, where you can do exactly this, where you can say, hey, I need these components always sort of on hand, please, please make sure I have. Okay, um, there's another thing I want to do. Uh, many things I want to do, many, many things. Let's... Okay, I have a question before I start anything. Give me... I know, many, many quick bars. I don't... Actually, can we maybe get rid of one? It feels like this is sort of an extra one that I don't need at the moment, or I can just sort of play with. Right. Uh, what I was looking for is something for spawn. I don't know what you call it. Uh, it's, a, it's a health station. No, it's a... Something station. No, it's not. Crud. Uh, what is it? Like, is it? It's a. Uh, I want the upgrade from the survival kit. Well, it's not a survival kit I'm after. It's the. Leave me to it. Um, I, I, I can do this. I can do this. It's definitely not a power mod. I mean, warfare reactors. I mean, yeah, for that you need to find uranium. I haven't in my plays. I haven't even found any uranium yet. So it's it's all good, you know. Still plenty to be found and done. Industrial blocks? No, I don't think so. This is just uh, the, what you call it, the the lightning rod. Thank you. I was trying to find the name before I went over it. Antenna dish. Dummy industries is the build and repair. Protective block, no. The consumer loads, it's, it's cockpit blocks, but it's not one needing. Is that a block tool? No, it's not. Is it? Okay, maybe I'm missing something. Um, I know actually exactly what I'm looking for, to be honest. I, I just can't mind the damn name of it. Uh, no, 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 it's none of this. It's none of this. Because I've built one of them already, and I thought that would have just unlocked the next tier. But let me. Uh, no, 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 thruster is cockpit blocks. Uh, was this. Uh, yeah, 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 I think we're heading towards the right. Now this is just a hydrogen engine, which, okay. Uh, oxygen farm, cryo chamber, it's something along those sort of lines. What is it called? It's not an oxygen farm. I mean, come on. It's a... Uh, I know it's nifty in chat either that can tell me right now. What is the upgrade to this called? And why is it so hard to find? I mean, it's not a survival kit part. 
no, no, no. Um, it's not part of a programmable block, which I didn't think it was, anyways. ATM store, no, no. Air vent. It's not an oxygen tank. It's not an oxygen farm. Oh, this is bugging me. This is genuinely bugging me now. What the damn, damn thing is called. Okay, let me... It was further down that I'd seen a, at least similar block here. Right, so an O2, O2 H2 gen leads to a cryo chamber, which leads to that... that that second one in the cryo chamber. And I, I don't know what it's called, but okay. I. Do I. I have an O2H2. Do I need to build an oxygen farm? Okay, question. Can I build an oxygen tank? Yes, I can. Honestly, I am a little bit confused here, guys. It's, and I'm sure it's something super easy and super simple that I'm just not understanding, right? Um, it's not a production block, apparently. It's not a survival kit type item either. Okay. And it certainly shouldn't be a power block. So I'm just going through all the, all the possibilities now that I think are even they're just standard large blocks. Like oh no, all large blocks, but well wait now. All large blocks right is there somewhere in here. You know, I have a feeling, and just just bear with me, um, what tanks do we have? We have hydrogen and oxygen, right? Oh, that was long as sizes. Um, so, uh, right, just give me those for now. And we're going to just start building some of these. Right. And normally what I do is I just sort of plunk them on the top here. So there's got to be an oxygen one. Stick that there. And then the hydrogen one. Oh my sh shoot. Okay, that's, that's a bit bigger than I thought it would be. Uh, can you? Yes, you can. Oh, do you have side ports too? Oh, well. But no, not 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 in this case, please. Can we just sort of do maybe this? Does, does this sound reasonable? Okay, let's go and put this stuff together, shall we? Cool, give me what I need then, please. All items were successfully withdrawn. I love this. Awesome. We have an oxygen tank. It hasn't unlocked anything. I, I thought I would have, but it didn't. Fine. Put you together. What, you think we don't have the ingredients? Well... Do like so. Yep. And then it's gonna... Yeah, more steel tubes, but the rest has already been made. Um, I love auto crafting. Honestly, it's 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 one of the best things in life. 
Um, but we could just sort of look, slowly go and just withdraw them. I want to replace the survival kit. That is my whole point. This is what I'm trying to get at. I mean, come on, it can't be this difficult, right? And I thought if I'd done this, unlock new blocks, maybe, maybe now. Right, cool. And I know it's ugly as sin and, and, and all that. I don't care. Uh, give me that bar back, please. Now, I want the production blocks. I said production blocks, please. Uh, no. No, that's just refinery. Uh, what would that even be under? Like, I would have thought maybe, like, survival or so, but... It's not... Is it a block tool? No, that's, like, grinders, drills, welders. Um, cockpit block? Most likely not. It's not consumable, it's a... What really is it? Uh, this is what I don't... Uh, certainly not an industrial block, right? No. Honestly, this, this is really confusing me right now. Where is the damn thing? I know exactly what I'm looking for. It doesn't look like I've unlocked it yet. Where was it? It was right here, right? So we've done this part. Done this part. Do I need to build an oxygen farm for that? To get to that? I, I don't know. It's a cryo chamber that I'm looking for. But... You know what? Let's Let's just make one. An oxygen farm, okay, and then cryo chamber. Can I build? I, I can build a cryo chamber. No, that. Ah, how is this a cryo chamber? Can, can someone please explain what I'm missing? Oh, right, okay. I understand. I understand. I understand. Then we have yes, a medical room. Thank you. This is the, that's the word I was looking for. So how does this connect? Oh, really? At the bottom? And let me guess at the top too? Right. And that's a cargo container. Alright, okay. Um, idea. Uh, yes, idea. It's probably not a good one, but we'll see. Chop this block away. Oh, crap. Right, and then go and chop this guy. Right, let me just check. Oh, that's a single block. Ah, uh, I didn't think that through. I did not think that through at all. But, uh, okay. We are reversing those changes. <laughs> uh, give me, please. Where was it? Wait. What's this an oxygen farm? Actually, why not? Let's put... An oxygen farm? No, I can't. Yes, I can. Does it need access? Where does it need? It needs access. Okay. Uh, also, why did you not weld that up? Thank you. We need to just put that other thing back in, I think. Uh, yeah. Sorry. Um in here. 
Air chamber, medical room. That's that's the two. I mean, it's it's fine, but it's um. Uh, this guy won't need so survival kit for now. And then I need to find a spacing where I can do this whole medical room thing. That's just what it is, right? It's part and parcel of how you play this game. And what I might do... Um, let me see. We do it somewhere sneaky back here. Can we, can we do a thing here? Can we... Yeah, yes we could. We could get supplies. We could... Or even just string it down this way. Okay, so... You and you... you, you uh, okay. You? You coming with me? And you are coming with me, right? Because what we're going to do is we're going to da, 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 da. yeah, something like so, right? What? 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 Why? You know, why not? Really? Right, and then all we're just going to need to do is literally just come back right up. Bam, bam. And there we go. Right, everything's fully pulled up. I, I honestly feel like this should pull in. Pull in. So that's what... Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I, I honestly think I can pull that in. It's, I want to really try that for a particular reason, right? And just, just bear with me, please. I have a sort of slightly mad, but hopefully working idea. I, I, I don't know. And it's you that we're not needing. We're gonna pull you in. And boom. That looks good. Yes. This is what I had in mind, because, if I am not mistaken, needs more, needs more steel plate, needs more steel plate for sure, but I don't think all that much, look, look at this, this is all I wanted, just built me a little sort of platform out here, right, and we're just going to go and just bring it right out to however far our base is going, yeah, that'll do, right, and Build repair will just do that for us too. Is a thousand enough? Just like a 25 per block that we're welding. Be interesting to see. The assembler is making these guys. I'm trying to see how quickly it gets through it, but we may need to. Oh, but I think it's keeping up well ish. You know, it's it's fine. But yes, now see, this is what I wanted. I wanted a whole platform here where I can walk along here. Can we possibly? We can we be that cheeky? Yeah, that is nice. Okay, nice. And then we're gonna just finish that off on those three blocks. Just to extend the base out a little bit more, give it a nice footprint. And this, yes, I'm, I'm happy with this. Uh, we've got a deep dank hole. I am very tempted to try and just... Oh, gravel's all disappeared. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't tell me you've gone and done the whole thing of pulling the gravel back in. No, he hasn't. It must have despawned then. Nice. Then I am happy with this. Shall we... Shall we do upgrade modules? Maybe one or two? Like, I, I would maybe get a speed module on here. Let's see. Modules. Yeah, just like that, right? And so, again, we're using the mouse wheel to change the module. This is a speed module. Power efficiency and yield. 
think I'm going to do a yield on this side. And then you want to make sure that those slots obviously align on the assembler, just like so. And then obviously I can't, because that's just me. Oh, can't because button panel. Let me guess. Yeah, 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 yeah. I can't because button panel. Um, what is this? I said, is this a this is a yield module? Uh, it might be almost worthwhile just because I can't do a better one to just do power efficiency here. Right. I I just feel that maybe the better call there. Um, which is fine. Oh yeah, it's not going to weld that up, is it? Just nice. Remember, we, we, we want that. What do you mean I cannot withdraw those? Right, we're done. Dust it. Uh, empty build planet, thank you. That was a bit weird. Go and put all that back, but at least. Right, this guy seems to be very hungry. So I will give um, one, two, I don't know, like, I want to give him power efficiency, or you know, yeah, power efficiency for sure. Um, and then I feel like a yield module would probably be in order. like so maybe right and then just go and weld up what we can oh superconductors what is that what are, what, what are we need for that <clears throat> production superconductor is gold and iron we, we we have gold I um, yes we have I would have thought we had more gold I would have honestly thought we had a lot more gold than that. Because that doesn't seem an awful lot. But it, it must have... Has it been enough? I don't know. Alright, oh, okay. So you're not even aware that's ha that that is a thing. Right? What about you? What, what do you need? You're, you're easy. Okay, you're actually easy. Okay, well, successfully withdrawn, love that. And then we're just gonna have to go and get the gold. That's just what it is. have anything no there's nothing in the build plan okay so we're gonna do this and this I would like to see what you say to that superconductor situation required I don't think he's gonna have enough not by the looks of it unless I'm missing something in my inventory UFE. Just looking through ores, right? Um, CUFE, that's cobalt and iron. That's it. I think that's it. I think, yeah, okay. We're gonna have to go and get gold. Gold! There'll be gold in them dark hills. So, in the industrial cockpit. Also, there's another thing I want to, I would like to do is groups. That is a no, no, not not base power storage. What are you talking about? No, no, my my, my rover batteries. Where are they? Is it these? Aye. Oh, it's because it's a mixed group of. Yes. Uh, I think we'll say recharge on off. That's sort of my. Okay. Uh, I've I've done the thing again. Right, I, I, I consistently do this rover batteries. So, you 
are auto, 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 right? Then we have these guys. Auto. Right now they're on auto, and I can say, "Hey, go and do a charge." And I would imagine it's literally gonna try and soak dry the was it the. Yeah, they are full. So if we go in and look at these batteries, so there's a uh, battery, something that's attached. Uh, Thirteen minutes, you know. So yeah, it's 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 going to absolutely pull, fully depleted in seventeen minutes. So you know, it's not a nice thing to do to your base. So let's go and turn that off and set it to auto. Just want to make sure. Sorry, wrong direction. Uh, I want to have a look at. Yeah, now we're recharging them. Nice. Okay, cool. We're, we're good to go, right? Let's go. And the handbrakes are off. We're still locked in. Let's go and not be locked in. Right. I am going to... We're going back there. I feel that is nice enough to do because, well, we know the area. We know we've got good amount of cobalt there as well if we need it anymore and it's not too far away as opposed to some of the other points you know it's it's i like it um you know all the stuff that we do need is on let's turn build repair on just in case this block's not built up or um and then obviously mind your surroundings you know any wrong bump any any deep deep dank, uh, what you call it, um, ditch, and yeah, your, your rover's history. Uh, I got away lucky in episode, was it four, I think? Um, that was more luck than anything, to be honest. Right? That that should never have ended up in me still retaining a halfway intact rover. And this is going to be interesting because, yeah, here's, so here's my, my waypoint, right? This is what I've set up and this is where I've sort of parked. I would expect, yes, slowly come to a stop. Nice, stop. Um, see, these can be turned off realistically, but no, we're going to leave them on. Don't need the gyros on. Build and repair can go and do one just now. Actually, not mean to go into third person camera because it is night time, of course. I went and aligned with iron, that's, that's what I'm sure of, right? So it must be sort of this way, maybe. Because certainly that's what I aim for to begin with. I find this part frustrating. Thanks. I'm sure I'm at the right, what do you call it, uh, I'm at the right node. Very, very positive of that. Just well, uh, just with the fact that I follow my way, my, 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 my waypoint here. I think it was sort of up the hillish. I was expecting to see it. Note to self, next time mark the entrance a bit better. 
something like that one. No, we're not going to cheat time. We're not going to say, hey, we can just change the way time shows to us. But no, nope, not going to do that. I'm going to try and I feel this is sort of the right direction. It's sort of up here-ish. Probably going to fall into it too. Need jetpack just wait. Oh, for goodness sakes. Okay. Um, are we going to dig a new hole? I suppose we are. And no, wait, I need, I need that gold, don't I? That's, that's, see, that's, 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 that's the whole, the other thing. Wait. Let's get closer and see what we can do there. No. No. This way it seems to, no. Nah, it is literally right on us. Okay. And we're going to have to do the... Space and yes, dump or jump or or dance, whatever you want to call this. That we that we that little thing, that little ditty. Come on. It's really finicky in, in third person perspective. I did not like that at all. But you couldn't get a consistent hit on a patch and just keep going. No, you can if you crouch. Okay. <coughs> so, yeah, we're doing the. Uh, I don't like this particularly, but eh. I'm too lazy to look about for more. <laughs> yeah. Again, I can only apologize, you know, for the OBS mess up there, missing a whole hour's worth of footage. It was good too, like, well, nothing groundbreaking, but you know, I, I enjoy my stream and what I do, so. So, yeah, we're just gonna keep going for this gold right now. But you can see how these different materials are sort of your next stepping stones to, you know, the next pieces of technology. How you need to find a good resource, uh, uh rather, you need to find the resource first, and then you need to... Wait, we were literally 12 meters away from the thing. You know you're telling me it's not? Oh, come down just a bit more. Say it's that direction. Like that's that's a bit of a dick move. What, what have you done there? This gold seems to be sort of jumping all over the place here. It's a little bit. There we go. Right, we we found the thing. Okay, let's go. Just. Grab as much as you can. Yeah, I know there's gold and then there holds because I gone and dug for it. But this drill is obviously very slow with gold apparently. But I think this all comes down to the fact that 
there isn't actually all that much gold in this rock, which is again why you need that healed module to really help you out there. So I definitely want to make sure that I grab as much of this as I can. And it always seems to come in small chunks too, like this never big jumps in your inventory. You know, sometimes there is, but I think there's more stone, to be honest. Hey, if I was to check right now, well, would you look at that? I thought so. I mean, that's just... But the gold itself is really rare, really hard to get to. And the little that you do have, yeah, you want to make sure that you're fine in it the best of your ability so this is where the yield modules come in and I've seen people actually do the full four yield modules not even you know two thoughts about it don't care what what the power usage is I just make sure I'm getting all the gold I can um, and I think it all depends again on sort of the size of the build you're planning as well um, I have no intention of doing mega bases, you know, anything like that. I'm just gonna, yeah. I, I just want to build a little something that you'll have learned the game enough and maybe taught it to other people in the process, you know, all that good stuff. But I'm not gonna do mega builds, at least not just yet. <laughs> um, I'm gonna take that as gold and just. Yeah, you do your thing, and we'll just chuck and stone all over the, the the environment. I'm not even caring. Just lie there in chunks and roll wherever it wants to. But yeah, no, I'm, I'm liking this. I'm liking this a lot. I think we've made good progress. I feel. Especially with that refinery and assembler, that's really going to make a big difference. Are we still alive? Yeah. Looks good. Um, <clears throat> so, you know, I'm happy with that. And, <clears throat> to be quite honest, I think we're going to leave it at that for today. Because I've been at this for three hours, even though you guys only have seen two of them. <laughs> um get the rover back home, get, you know, that last piece of, or the, those t two yield modules placed and, and built up. But yeah, I, f I feel we've done quite a lot today and made some progress. Expanded the base a bit. Bit more power gen. Um, so yeah, let's see. Um, oh, oh, just slow down. Oh. Oh, horsey ball. Right, and I'm just going to try and really line this up this time. Just slowly and carefully. Yes, lock in. And we should get our inventories emptied right away. Turn the lights off, turn the gyros off, turn all this off, turn that off. Because you don't have components at the moment anyway, so that's fine. And I now I would like to go and say, hey, go and just suit the base drive. I know it's not very charitable, but it's fine. Right, so. Can we please... Really? Have we? We've put them into production, right? Okay, then that's fine then. But yeah, you can see that we actually do need the assembler to actually get the components like superconductors, reactor components, and thruster components. Right. I still haven't seen anything that takes gravel, except for the reactor components. You know, um, but other than that, that silver and nickel. 
up or so up or not. Not. So it's literally no use for gravel in in the base game. I have seen uh, I think it was Kajashi who done that in what uh, Agonus, where yeah you can get weapons which can use gravel essentially as ammo. It's like okay, no, no, that's a use for gravel, but I I really feel like if you if you're making me make that much gravel, you should have a use for it. You you should have some sort of purpose for all that gravel. You should have a recipe or, or you know, something as a sink. No, that's that's really my, my, my sort of grievance there. We're missing that one resource sink for gravel. And even give me paving. Give me give me, you know, some structural or And maybe it's a thing that I've actually, uh, uh, absolutely missed yet. Like maybe I don't know about this particular thing yet that actually does take a lot of gravel. And if that was the case, I'll take it. I have a feeling you only got one in your... Yeah, you're missing 12. Right. And I think I would like to superconductors. Yes, please. Can we make sure that we have, say, 20 of them? Okay. Does that sound fair? Um, because they're a bit of a more expensive component for us at the moment. Yeah, just, just want to be... Make it a little bit easy, but it is already our first yield module. That's going to make a difference. Um, and you can see the percentages in the pro uh, in the control panel, right? So we've got power effectiveness of two hundred twenty-four percent, and we have a yield productivity one hundred percent, power efficient effectiveness. Um, so we've got an effectiveness effectiveness of one hundred nineteen percent already. And as soon as this is built up, we should see that go up a bit more even. So there's 141%. There you go. Nice. You know. So we're going to get a little bit more gold out of every single craft than we would normally get. It's not much at the moment, but it's, you know, it's enough. It's a start. Um, and then up there is just another conveyor that we could hook into or something. Right. Nice. Let's... Yeah, yeah. Um, <clears throat> no, you, you can stay off for now. Uh, everything is being produced. Do we want to do solar? I mean, it's raining at the moment, so wouldn't be much point. Or I'm not going to put another wind tower up. Um... Like, I'll be honest, this, uh, I know I said that Tarsus, you know, had actually sent me a video on an explanation on how to do scriptless um, solar tracking. I am not entirely certain I have fully understood it yet. So I'm sort of going to hold off on that until I've really understood it better and then can use it. And, uh, that is actually a stupid thing to do, Sebastian, because you're sort of blocking off your own access. It was this guy, right? Uh, I'll go and build this guy up. A whole bunch of stuff into production. What's this? Like, oh, this is gravel, right? This is just gravel being dumped because I am an idiot. So we need this block actually just disappeared. We we need to make you just not happen. And yeah, you can drop down the deep dank hole. That that is fine with me. Okay, cool. 
So, next. Fifteen medical components. Uh, yeah, that, and I think that's a silver problem. I think that is a silver... Ah, uh, yeah, okay. We should not have done that. We should not have put that into production. It was all just a really bad idea. Right now, anyways. Alright. Go and just put everything back, please. And then see this. Just ignore that. Okay. Also, you just, just go and ignore that, please. And so, yeah, we, we have all piping now. It is what it is. We have all piping. Cool. Um... I think I would like to try put another one top. I, I just feel like I want to supplement this power situation a little bit. So let me go and grab. Um, was it going to just be steel plate and where's my interior plate? Just like. Just like so for now, right? And it's really straightforward setup because I'm just gonna go and do another wind tower. So let's go and count, right? This is the middle block, so it doesn't count, but we need to be at least one, two, three, right? So that's one block, right? We're, we're one, one out, anyways. So we need to be one, two, three, four. This is the fourth block, if I'm not mistaken, right? One, two, three, four. This this is where the windmill actually ends. Then we want one free at least. So five. And this is where the other uh, the other windmill would end. So we're gonna go four, three, two, one, zero, go up. Right. Let me just confirm I've done this right. One, one, two, three, four. Four out, one free, one, two, three, four out, and there's the top. Yes, so one high, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We need to be ten above ground, and then one to get the clearance for the top windmill, right? Bum, bum, bum. Just get this, put that in there, and then we're gonna put you there. You go in there. You go in there. You go in there, and then, last but not least, stick you at the top, and voila! Wind Tower 2 is pretty much a thing now. Let's make sure it is. Um, and so what I want to do is mark wind tower one, and then grab all those. This is wind tower two. All right, save them. Oh, give me that name, please. Because why would I need to go and name it all? Well, we can just do this. All right, just boom. And replace name. There we go. Okay. Why you would say you're on a different grid, I have no idea. Okay, you, you've picked up that you're working. Okay, that's it. But we should now see better power production. So, for example, if I was to go and check on those batteries that we have at base. Uh, base power storage. There's those batteries. Let's just go and select one. Fully depleted in 43 minutes. My goodness. We're still not making enough power. Well, you know what? Let's supplement. I, ha I have an idea on supplementing energy here, right? Let's go and we're going to have one of those on the rover as well. Energy. Oh. 
engine hydrogen thank you so these are the big boys right they're quite chunky right they have a slot at the bottom and one sort of on that side uh ooh, ooh. Could, could, could we just do this thing like seriously can we just do that can we not just yeah put this together Give me the components. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Just do, just do so. Yeah, just, no, 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 just give me them. Give, give. You're putting it together, apparently. Can we maybe tell? I should hurry up with this. Uh, where is it? Turn it off. Just, just stop, please. Ah, oh, come on. Um, there we go. Go and withdraw, please. Something. Because I am... Okay, so that was not something that required us to actually finish it. Well, that's cool. Oh. Big dark hole. Don't fall into it. Uh, yeah, we can put a turn built and get back on. It's fine, you know. But this guy is running now, and so I expect somehow if I go and check you now, right, and go and check the base power storage, uh, check out one of those batteries, and we're fully recharged in 27 minutes. Yes! This is the business. This is what I'm talking about. Right, now we've got real energy production. Right, straight up from, <coughs> from um, hydrogen. Obviously coming out of uh, that tank up there, but... Who cares? We've got hydrogen actually doing something for us. Right. Except for <coughs> flying. I mean, flying is nice, don't get me wrong, but, you know, we, we now have it doing something else for us. Um, but, yeah, so we've done, as I say, we've done a lot. We've, we've... Sorry, guys, I cannot leave it like that. I, I, it bugs my happiness when things are floating in the air. Even though I was the one to do it. Uh, uh, uh. It's not a thing. I cannot leave it. What? Can I not pull this through? Why not? Yeah. But I don't need a thousand. I wanted to just... What is going on here? This is a bit weird. I know it can't pass through small conveyors. That's the whole point. Give me just a hundred. Please. That's, that's all I wanted. I mean, all I want to do is just fix this. 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 Yeah. Thank you. Right. No, 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 you should still be working, right? Yeah. Keep pushing the wrong button here. Um, but so there you go. We, we have more power production. Um, we have automatic crafting. We have inventory management. Uh, yeah. You know, we've got all the big things to really get us going to get into space. I think I can confidently say that we really have everything together now. And, oh yeah, look at this, battery's full. Oh, this is well off to see. Yes, 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 yes. It can come off charge now. I, that, that's all I wanted. Um, let's just go and actually unlock from base. Right. Turn the gyros off, turns off everything off, turn the handbrake on, and, and <clears throat> bring me up. And then lock those in and turn the lights off, uh, turn everything off, right? Whoa! I did not realize we had lost a whole thing there. What, did we just rip it off? Or it didn't unlock it, seemingly. Okay. That happens. I didn't like that it happened and I don't know why it would do it. It 
there was no reason for it to be extended and all that. But okay, it's a thing that's happened. Let's go and fix it now. Because I, I can't leave that. Um, please add a piston head. Right. That we're going to try and put together. There we go. Yeah, yeah. Large steel tube. Well, guess what? You have that. Yeah, it, because wrong container. We can't do that there. So get this finished, and then get a landing gear under there. And so crouching is not going to help us. We're going to go and use the jetpack. Right. No, come on. What are we doing here? For some reason, you are a great disappointment to your mother and I. It won't even let me go and try and attach it there. What on earth is going on here? This is so weird. There, that's it. That's the front, right? All this turns out I don't even have a steel plate to do it. No, I, I really don't. Let's go and grab more of that thing. I, I don't know what I'm doing wrong here, but for some reason it's not like me pulling through items. Into that. That connector, why does that connector? Actually, an idiot. So, go and give me that inventory. Give me that. Yeah, Sebastian is an idiot, turns out. Components are not meant to go through that particular connector. Uh, right. I'm just getting this landing gear put on guys, this, this is all I'm wanting for today, and then it's calling it. No, not that way. That's, that's the boot. Yeah, no. Yes, that is it, actually. That was painful. Anyways, there we go. Right, I just need to quickly fix the group here. Where is it? The maintenance lift lock as this landing gear to save. We need to go and lock it. Oh, it's locked. Right, that means if I know we'll say eight, they're all unlocked. There is one of them is still locked in. Or oh, I've, I've really messed it up. Oh yeah, I have because... Uh, why? This, this should do it now. We should be getting pulled in. And... Oh, that does not look right. It's for another time. We have done quite a lot today. As I say, we've expanded power, we've built more batteries, we've got connectors for our vehicles, or vehicle so far. We have better assembler and uh, refinery facilities, and yeah. Just one, we, we, we have a deep dank hole fully dug out by this contraption. Right, I like it. So, thanks for watching. I'm gonna go and head off and enjoy the rest of my Sunday. Thanks for watching again. Please leave a like and subscribe if you want to. If you like the content, if you've got questions, leave them down in the doobly-doo. Or hit me up on Discord. And, yeah. Until tomorrow. 
Peace out. Safe. Yes. And goodbye.